So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Well, thank you very much, Mr Drury, and hello to everyone. Up and running. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Well, I'm going to pick Mats Hummels. Um, he's not simply a very dependable and, and diligent defender. He has real adventure about him as well. And I think when he gets an opportunity to step out from the back, he's encouraged to keep going, and, and he doesn't. He, uh, he goes all the way. Yeah, I must agree, especially in view of his ability to lead and organise the defence. Seldi out to the flank. That's well blocked and back out it comes. This could fall anywhere. Tries to get it forward quickly. Back to the keeper and try something new. Hamshik, Koulibaly, it's a long forward pass. Well, that's where he wants it. Good effort first time. Well, the contact was absolutely perfect for me, but the direction was, was pretty ugly, and that really was a, a back-to-the-training-ground moment. Spoon forward. Jeffrey Kondogbia. A decent early chances. It bodes well for an exciting game. Looks like a good ball through. Mauro Icardi looking to get on the end of this. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. Kaya Hon. Now the pass. And it's Icardi. Clearance now. Can anyone get on the end of it? It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Good challenge. He just stood firm. The other side yet able to force a breakthrough here. Jeffrey Kondogbia. Matia. That's 
surely a foul free kick. Santon gets it away. Kandreva. Mathieu. Where to from here? Shot a goal! Oh, a very decent attempt. Oh, he really wanted that. Well, he went at it with great confidence, and it's not going to stop him from trying again. Coaxed out to the wing. Yeah, it wouldn't have been the most eye-catching goal we'd seen. Ultimately, the numbers prevented him from scrambling it in. Jeffrey Kondogbia gets it back. Koulibaly aimed long and direct. Played in by Kayahon, and that's been repelled. Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Look forward. What does he try from here? Looks to slip it through. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Goal! Inter! Could that be the start of something big? Mauro Icardi with the smoothest one-on-one -on -one finish. He is one very cool customer. Yeah, he always had the measure of the keeper and there was very little doubt as to how this was going to end up. Into Milan, give themselves the perfect start. Can they build on it? Kaya Hock. Now the cross. Massive leap! Great early ball. Same can't be said for the finish. Look, there'll be no complaints at all with quick service like that. It's so difficult to defend when the ball comes in so swiftly. But you can't question the finishing in this instance. I think, though, there's enough grounds for them to keep working at it. Looking to get within range. That is going to be the final action of the first half. Do it back on the first 45 minutes. Well, they're playing a game of wait and wallop. Uh, let the opposition have the possession and, and defend in numbers. Uh, and then wallop hit them hard um, and fast on the break. It's worked once and they can do it again. Into Milan, leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments and it's 1-0 at the break. Inter going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Lorenzo Insignia with a delicate ball. The keeper's got good distance on that. He's made sure that that won't get through. Koulibaly. It's Kaya Hon. Hampshire. Kaya Hon. Alaba tries a long pass towards the front. Alaba. Icardi. Napoli have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but. What's their thinking? Um, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. Battles to win it back. Maro Icardi. 
Can Draver. Terence Kongolo pumps it upfield. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, and what they've got to realise, Peter, is that they won't get away with excessive force for long, so they're running a fine line there. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Terence Congolo. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong message. This could backfire. Neuer deals with it effortlessly. Alaba boots it upfield. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frighten the people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind, but the runners from midfield too. Napoli have a sub ready to come on. <laughs> Jeffrey Condopia. Who's going to make this theirs? Now it's Icardi. That's great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. Passes it through. Icardi. That is brilliant! Mauro Icardi! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe! Oh, that was a close call, but for me, he timed his run to absolute perfection there to stay just onside, and he's still a lot to do, you know, but I think he's tucked that away really well. Into Milan, take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or... Jeffrey Condogbia has got himself a free kick. has got rid of that, hit long and direct, doesn't get the pass he's looking for, yeah that does look a foul, referee's given a free kick. Clears it out of harm's way, Mats Hummels proves too strong there, Allen pumps it upfield. Challenge, he just stood firm. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Well, that's not the cross he had in mind. It'll be a throw in. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. Ball. Ambitious to say the least, he seemed to be in a hurry to get that in. Promising cross. Yeah, he's offering an apology for that. He needed to deliver a better ball. Jao Mario gets it back. Mattia, and it's Santo. It's one! Oh, it looked like 3-0 for sure. Oh, that could so easily have been game over. There would have been no way back from three behind. Oh, good interception. Thrust towards the front line. Koulibaly with the ball through. 
Well, he rushed into that and didn't give anyone a chance to get on the end of it. Biabiani. Vatia. Going for goal! Good stop, that wasn't easy. That wasn't the easiest of saves by any means, Peter, and I think his instincts were... Well, they were just razor sharp. that there will be four minutes stoppage time. Biabiani. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. And that is that. Simply, the big day was their day. A day for them and their fans. A truly proud line in their history. So on to centre stage come the central characters, the individuals who, as a team, blended into champions, and this is their moment. 